take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. They start seriously moving in October. Back on October 1, 1988, bird watchers counted over 60,000 robins migrating over Duluth in northern Minnesota, so that's serious migration. But in fall and winter, robins don't stay in a single spot for long, they wander about searching for new sources of still fresh fruits. Take our lead. According to some cultures, seeing a flock of robins in my yard in peak winter symbolizes danger. Against the white background of the snow, the robin's striking red chest stands out, and red is usually a sign of danger. Let's help you make your mark. It's difficult to estimate just how much sleep they actually get, but what we do know is, they prefer to rest in secluded, sheltered places away from predators. Robins build their nests low to the ground in shrubs, climbers, and hedges. Let's help you make your mark. Food availability and weather greatly influences where Journey North citizen scientists actually report seeing flocks of American robins. When one source of food, nuts, berries and fruit, becomes depleted, American robins move to another location. Make your mark, take our lead. Robins can be found year-round almost anywhere south of Canada. Birds that breed from Canada to the north slope of Alaska leave in fall for the U.S. Some robins winter as far south as the southwest, Mexico, and the Gulf Coast. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.